Z-Rad. Greetings and salivations, everyone, and welcome to another Christique Corner on C-Rad. I'm Krista, and this is my little corner of our channel where I do reviews, DIYs, and talk about things that I think are totally rad. So if you like this video and want to see more, make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn on that notification bell so you don't miss seeing us in the future. Something a little bit different today. I've been doing a lot of Baby Yoda stuff, I know. But those of you who know me know I am a huge The Walking Dead fan. And along with being a huge The Walking Dead fan, I am also a very, very big, huge Ryan Hurst fan. He is one of my favorite people on the planet. And yes, I've had the honor of meeting him a few times. He is such an awesome person and I love him to death. So when I heard he was going to be Beta on The Walking Dead, I was so excited. But of course it took them a season or so to get some Beta merchandise out there for us. Still waiting on that Funko Pop Funko. Come on, we need a Beta Funko Pop. Guys, come on, hit Funko up, let them know. There's an alpha one, we need a beta one. So anyway, if you like The Walking Dead and you are not caught up on season 10 yet, stop watching the video now. I know I really don't like telling people to stop watching my videos, but there might be some little itty bitty spoilers in this, so stop watching now. So right before Christmas, they had come out with the beta t-shirt. My mother-in-law had gotten me this for Christmas. This is my first time showing it on a video. The sleeves are kind of cut up and the collar's kind of cut up like it's all worn. It is a thicker t-shirt and it is kind of warm out for it today. I like my t-shirts thinner. I like my collars lower. So I'm actually contemplating cutting this out and maybe cutting the sleeves down a little bit. But I've got beta on me so I'm a happy girl. I love this shirt and I was gonna wear it to Comic Con this year and then Comic Con got cancelled. Thank you COVID. But anyway, such is life and life goes on. But after the beta shirt came out, they still did not have much beta merchandise on Shop the Walking Dead. Guys, come on, Ryan Hurst has a huge fan base and I know he's playing a bad guy, but more. More beta merch. We will buy it. We will. I promise. <laughs> but in season 10, we finally got a little bit of a backstory on beta. And right after that, they did come out with two new items on the Shop the Walking Dead website. And I have both of those to show you. But before I go on, I did want to say the t-shirt is still available on the website. It's $29.95. And also keep out because they just finished a Christmas in July special where I think there was like up to 40% off some stuff. But they do offer deals every once in a while. So keep an eye on the website. Sign up for their emails and they'll let you know when there's specials. But $30 if you're a huge Ryan Hurst and Beta fan, totally worth it. So the other two things that I got, the first thing that I got was... This really cool replica of the Half Moon poster that was in the episode where we got the little bit of a backstory about Beta. Here's my spoiler alert, guys. It's where he turned out that in his former life he was a country singer called Half Moon. How funny is that? And there was actually a clue to it a little bit earlier in the season when was it um, I think Magna was listening to a record and the guy was singing this low slow country song that was actually Ryan singing that song as Half Moon so definitely cool Ooh, and another fun fact about that song that song was actually written and sung by on her album by Emily Kinney who used to play Beth on the show how awesome is that? But anyway, I got this cool little half moon poster that's going to live on my wall in my office. Just like it was in the episode. Now it is, it's not poster material, it is glossy. It's pretty much just a photo. But $14.95, totally worth it to me because that's just like a little piece of the show for me. I love it. And the other thing that I got is also Half Moon related and I got the poster first and then I had to pre-order these and I waited forever for them. They were actually because of COVID they came late but look at this it's like a little album cover. 
Half Moon Live in Concert. Live in Concert Half Moon. What could be inside? They're little records. <laughs> They're actually coasters. They're vinyl. And they are made to look like little vinyl albums. And we got Ryan's little half moon face on there. They're really cute. The back of them just looks like a regular type vinyl. I think they're super awesome. And they are, they're plastic, they're really thick. They're actually thicker than actual vinyl, but I'm not gonna use mine as coasters because I don't wanna ruin this little bit right here on him, but I think these are a really cool collector's item. These were $24.95, and also these are still available on the Shop the Walking Dead website as well. And that's it, I just wanted to show you my beta love and my beta stuff real quick just to do something a little bit different and review something that I was wanting to review and hadn't. If you like The Walking Dead, I'll have some more of The Walking Dead stuff coming up in the future. It's pretty much one of my all-time favorite TV shows. It's definitely in my top five. I love the entire Walking Dead universe. Fear the Walking Dead. Cannot wait for World Beyond. So awesome excited that we finally got dates for that that were announced this past week at Comic-Con. But that's about it for now. So if you like this video, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos like this, subscribe to the channel, turn on that notification bell so you don't miss seeing us in the future. And let me know in the comments, hey, I love The Walking Dead too. Do some more Walking Dead videos. <laughs> we actually have one from Comic-Con last year, if you missed it. It's right here. Watch it. It was pretty fun. But anyway... That's it, guys. There's only one thing left to say. We'll see you later.